discuss how we unite the maroon them in our with differences with the different indigenous cultures them where we have in a jamaica formalize them organize them out put them where who forget them rights alex you say around the so nanny come from that the person say around the so that make we have a conversation around it make we put everything on the table as a collective everybody busy depending on the commission everybody want to be king who no want to be king want to be queen who no want to be this want to be that who and nobody no see the plight of the people who are dead and are suffer no one now come to them rescue no time soon i don't know how somebody explain to me everybody they hear and have the answer and know what to do know how to go about it know who to call know who to talk to forget what done but nobody no willing to do it for the right reasons, which is to center the people around who them really is, what them true history is, why we chop up and share up, share up so, seeing, and why it is that is the masses that is standing in the middle of this big old um, shooting to and from with these different people we surround with and suck out with energy. And when them sister we now yield, them turn to food and drinks. And give it food and drinks. If you notice, the brother when he in low sat, when he in chuck round at the most sacred island parish, round at Portland, because vars them round their ramp, seeing, then chuck him round there, and as the difference. Oh, 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 I said for be the difference to vars. You, you break that down and tell me how you gonna get the I two same thing. They only look different. I have different strategies. Yeah, I see. I know no difference. I see him think it only I got worse now. Because in a philosophy, him literally I tell you say, a KFC a film national dish. A food where you diabetes and all kind of communicable diseases or communicable diseases, what the fuck the word is. Seeing at that him a push. But you know, I lift him up in a, in a, in a, in a, in a, the comet chair. I can't go put him around there in a, the comet chair. When the comet supposed to be the comet. I would have love to see the comet organize up. Because if you can't organize everything else, might as well just come organize the people them the right way. Then the man organize them and turn them in a sheep and I send them gone. No. Rumbar and I send them gone. No. Saddam is him, man. You know? Come do it for the right reason, man. We don't know so no we're not powerful for true, man. Then the people don't make no powerful, man. Remember, from the people in Das, you know, that's why I don't know how the people in Das me, you know. Because I don't know so if the people in Das are you know, no powerful, one go. But where the people in you know, Das, you know, for my lord, if you do this to we, if you do this to we country, I don't know how to get in Das for. If you bring Jamaica to its knees and turn you over to, 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 to the devil and to Saddam. I that you know, I that to not do, brother. I that to not do, my lord. The wall I don't know. I that to not do. We no kill out the freedom fighter. Them we no kill out the people. Them when they do willing to go all the way. We no kill them out. We no kill them out. And we no take it wrong. No, when I say come in, devil, are like you? Yeah, work with. Yeah, them not see for yeah, them self, man. Those of those who not eat the KFC, man, and this is fast food, them, man. Whoever won KFC, I don't know what say. You know what say? Me don't know who won KFC, but you see the people, them, we buy out the KFC franchise. We are a wicked set of people, man. We is a wicked set of people, we buy out the franchise, them, my fast food place, them out there, man. I make KFC be Jamaica people's staple meal, man. We no wicked, man. Just to make money. We know a killer and then we don't know says so a slow death. We don't know the people now are just dead overnight. So we don't have hospital ready. We don't have pharmacy. We don't looking at the inner city them them have pharmacy like bar pan every corner now. We no in a fear, man. Jamaica people did into them health, man. And love healthy eating. A seafood we be. A seafood we like eat and vegetables. Not even chicken wasn't a staple meal of original Jamaican. Original Jamaican staple meal of fish, man. Yes, that's why we don't take where the sea from we. We don't take where the sea. We don't drive out the fisherman. Then we go see, go look the real warm deep water fish them and them thing they were used to feed off of. 
Who no take you away from we. And I give we be a fake fish. Uh, KFC chicken fake. Bumbo cloth. I love meat. Where do you get so much chicken from? Hmm? They are using food to change our children DNA. They are using food to change our children DNA. Them are you are what you eat. Them are use food for change you know. Them are use food and drinks for change you know. That's why we not have no resistance down here. That's why we do a They met they made the item do a my people. You see me, with the drinks and the food, and then them have the, the influencers now. For influence, the docile mindset. So, we are just an island of walking zombies. Because even if you not take part in the darkness, you yeah, eat the food. You yeah, eat the food. There yeah, I see. A, a farming, the artists, them for them on social media, encourage. Because that's one of the things now where we are going to in a flag staff where we are going to meet the youth, them, the young youth, them, you know, the nice youth, them, we love just up and go party. And they, enough, enough of them, big up yourself, Kevin. Enough of the youth, them, do them farming already now, still. But we are going to bring it now to our next level. We are going to show the youth, not just flag staff, but right across the island, we are trying to encourage people from all around the world who want to indulge. In other kind of trade there, agriculture, where we can no chemical food, no chemical food. The, the, these big necks, allegedly these G Bill Gates and all them sending all kind of experimental fertilizers are coming out with island. You see what I say? And I, and I work experimenting with crops them and with food them with them. The agriculture minister, the war them for God jail. Health minister for God jail. Agriculture minister for go to jail, education minister for go to jail, all of them for go to jail for what they do to Jamaican people, psyche, because those are the things. Entertainment minister for go to jail, the all of them for go to jail, them for go for what they do to a country. Letting in all these wicked medicines, these wicked foods, them cut out civil society, all of the unions, them where they farm. To protect citizens' rights and consumer rights in Jamaica. All of them cut out and unleash the beast from Jamaica people in our food and drinks and culture and do this to it down here because on say we know nobody fit talk for we again. The whole of no figure jail, the whole of no figure jail for what we do to it. Saying, me remember the prime minister saying that is God make the vaccine. And me cry the day when me watch it. Me ball because me sissy in selling soul and him about to make Jamaica people be the, be the brown, bear the brunt of it. And as so said, see we are. All the reports, I can go in my phone right now and look up the report. I'm going to put the link. Where you guys can go look at the report that proves that it was not even a vaccine. It wasn't even a vaccine. And look how much Jamaican body eating now. And we are wonder why the country stays so and why all of a sudden Jamaica just look how we look. You know, don't play with the people then we love God, don't you, man? You see me? And your oldness should not walk away out of this country without giving account and giving us a report on, on COVID. We would love a report from, from Mr. Tufton and Mr. Oldness on COVID. Where are we with it now? What happened? Who took the things? What happened to them? What happened to our elders then? What happened to our young people? I am counseling young people who was forced to take it while they were on their jobs. And they would lose their jobs if they didn't take it. And now, they have a sickness every day that they cannot explain. 
How we are fear pumping bitters and them something there in a them body to see if we can even find back them normal immune system. Who will bear a, who will give account for those Jamaicans? I remember corporate society was giving out slices of pizza, phone cards. The betting company of Jamaica was giving away betting tickets, lot of tickets to go take it. But we don't have nobody now to give away lot of tickets and pizza slices to stop violence in Jamaica against women and children and our young people. Where are the pizza slices for that? Where are the pizza slices? Where are the free tickets? Where are the checks? If we don't have peace on the island, where are those people? Where did they go? All the people who rolled out like we have never seen before say that they love Jamaica and they're in a hurry to help. Where are you? We are dying as a result of that help. Where are you guys to come help us now? We need help. Jamaica people need help right now. Because it's about to get worse, you know, guys. You see, everything we've been talking about is about to get worse. We just don't want to be spreading no fear mongering. That's why we're saying prayer. That's why we're saying the, the church leaders, them, for tie up in our cage and left in there, like what Tisslewood them used to do. We left them in the sun. I make them burn. I make rain wet them again. I make them burn again and so. It must happen. They, they, they gave us up to the devil. They gave us up to the devil, Jamaican people. They gave us up to the devil. And because of our vulnerabilities, we giving in. We giving in and then they're going to blame us and say it's our culture. And say it's this we love. And says, this we want. Is this we love? Is this we want? Is not this we love? Is not this we want? Not if I even in the memory of who me know my country to be. This is not who we are. This is not who we was. This is not the intentions that we had for our young people. This is not the intention that we have for our, our young people. And let me tell you something. The biggest of demons. I don't have to talk anything else about Andrew Olness, them government anymore. Because you guys are seeing for yourself that their, their chicken have come home to roost. I am turning my attention to who is coming in. And let me tell you something. I have been trying to talk to Mr. Mark Golden. I send him texts. To ask him if he going to really be that government now. That is going to be the government that is really going to show us how the devil rule the world. Because let me tell you something. PNP government that you see coming in. The amount of demon will line up. Remember when I went to the Grand Gala, you know, And said no homosexuality in Jamaica and marijuana should be legalized, you know. It was Lisa Anna who write a letter and put it. You can go look it up. It's in the archives. Either Gleena or Observer. One of them paper there. She put a letter in there stating that she regretted putting Queen Africa and the Grand Gala because of the gay backlash that started. However, it was a man with name and it was Venetia Phillips. Of the PNP who told me this. Seeing I'm not mincing no words now. I'm talking plain now. Seeing. At the end of that night. Venetia William Phillips told me. That it was Sid Bartley. A man who was working under Lisa Anna. Who it is alleged. Let me use that word. To have molested five boys in the Glenmere High School. Seen? And as a result, parents made reports against him. And when it came to light, it was discovered that it was not only those five boys, but it was hundreds of boys. 
that it could be said that this man was molesting. Those were the people who were responsible, they say, for turning off my mic at the Grand Gala that evening. And from there so, this tarnish in the form of Archibald Garden and Milton Walker from TVJ, who Archibald Garden was the person reading news the evening, and Milton Walker was the producer of news that evening, who spread a propaganda against my name that my visa was taken away when there was no truth to go with it, no facts to back it. But they were in such a hurry to demonize Queen Africa name because they saw where I was going with my arguments towards the defense of my country and the fact that I saw that they were going to turn my country into the headquarters of Sodom and Gomorrah. So the PNP government, if you remember, they were also the ones who Portia Simpson, they got Portia Simpson to say, that she was going to legalize homosexuality when she became prime minister. The PNP government is in bed with the gay community. That is no joke. It has never been no doubt. It has never been any secret. If you remember Bebe from Montego Bay, it has never been a secret. The only thing with the labor right government is that they have been more careful in how they associate with their gay members. So everybody would know that, yes, you have gay members in, in labor right, but they know that the core of the labor right government would say that that's not their thing. But we saw that that's different now because the same Derek Morgan and Ramesh, them are labor right. They might figure prove otherwise, but they are showing that they are labor rights because they are the ones who went out on the labor right conference trail. Is them come a Swissly party come parade as labor rights. Over PNP side is Vibes Cartel, them and I sat them and the whole of them artists, they were over there, so I bat over there. So, do they know what they're batting for over there? Is PNP the real answer to the problems that Jamaica having? Or are we going to jump out of a frying pan into a fucking fire? Because I've been trying to engage with Miss Deborah Eklin, me been trying to engage with, Aunt, with Mark Golden to say, if you're going to be the difference at the end, Elm of PNP. Make we see it now. Make we see you get up and talk a little bit more than the political anecdotes them on the fling pan stage. Make we hear you get up and stand up and say, yeah, stand up with Jamaica people once and for all as an English Irishman. You're now going to make them take where Jamaica from regular Jamaican people and turn Jamaica into a citizen-led country in opposed to a national-led country. Me not see nobody over the opposition I do that. All me see them I do, I show the gay community of the world say them ready for be the gay community of the future is this not going to take up and go take on a finger and go say are they change that we may not talk about the people then we're gone you know me i talk about the regular jamaican them we really and truly want change and really i think say are these people them need to turn to for the change where them want are you guys going to be continuously be tricked by these people who continue to sell your half truths about yourself because they know that you don't know the full truth and so them can just come out and say, Make Queen I feel one chat, man. She I and stone rebel for a white woman and that's why she mad. No, continue to continue to listen to those kind of narratives in opposed to listen to the real truth we are staring down the face. The real solutions them will look can use as a people, for unite monks for uno self, so that no politician can't have no all over uno and no children them for the rest of no life. But for once and for all, uno can tell them, say, listen, we are going to do things different you now. If uno say uno do this, we are going to need to see uno do it. We are not going to take no talking no more from uno and say uno are going to do stuff, but we are going to want to see uno do it now. Is it, are we going to see a Jamaica like that anytime soon? Or are we going to see that trick by the big gay army that is coming in with PNP, think overthrow this year one year away. Yes, them have a gay army too. And a them sell we, them sell we to the devil, them sell we Billy House, sell we to the devil, and PNP you now are going to move in at the house now and finish we off. And that to not sign up for that, them are building no up towards in a Jamaican people. And that are the last hurrah where them are use the, 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 the comet them for. 
that are the, the artists them or that them are use them for as long as them concretize themselves in the new world now and have everything where them need all of them have to go figure out where them are going to do it for themselves because it's only promises they're making to them they're not planning to give them nothing more than to big them up for them efforts to help them to establish the demons them over you guys. So if you want to be the true powers of the country as the people, when them call the next election, nobody don't even look over there. Cut to no eye and looking at the empty plate them will not have full of promises. In the communities, them where yes, Mr. Andrew, I go hurry up and patch every road where he can find out because him thinks he a road patching, I go fix it alone. You know, if you patch the people, them art, you know, patch the people, them psyche, you know, patch the people, them psychological damages, them were well, no left in them head for centuries and centuries and centuries now. And that, you know, if you go patch. Say yes, because we need the roads, them of course. We need to fix every road before you cut, brother. Every corner, every way to fix before you know, cut. And PNP, you're not qualified to come in. You're not qualified for no levels, PNP. If I use, you're going to use. The facts that Jamaica people did prefer to suffer under you. Know. If I that you know, really are going to use, to wait for the next election, to call for Jamaica people out of frustration, like when Digicel did on floor. You remember when, when, when Lime did they kill off Jamaica people, cable and wireless? And then when Digicel come, the entire country go with Digicel. You know, remember that? At that, the election has come up now. The suffering that has been happening on the island for all these years is coming up now where the people are so frustrated that they're going to go throw themselves on PNP because they are the change. They are going to be the change, yes, but they are facilitating the mark of the beast. Damian Crawford supporting the mark of the beast. Damian Crawford, you know, say, you are support the mark of the beast. Lisa and them, the whole of them in there. If the right and the good people, them in a PNP, we are human being. Now stand up and separate themselves from the beast then we are coming with the gay movement in a PNP. That will be the death of Jamaica. If labor right, the people them in a labor right we are human beings, same way. Now get up and call out the beast them. Uh, uno I go go down with uno leaders. Nobody na go can help uno. Uno I forgot answer to God by uno self. Because I uno choose to turn against God and choose politicians as uno gods. And them tell uno if you do, how if you do, when if you do, where if you go, how. You know, look how them defend them one another. You know, how uh, them try to get me if you be one or the other. A time prove to all of them say, me is not with one or the other. Me is with the people. All when the people no know. All when them train the people, them fi hate we, fi disrespect we, fi look down pan we, fi be, we fi be the ones when I talk it out. I people them we are going. Same way. Because we are work off of the principles of how God run earth. Get up every day, the moon still shine, the sun still shine, the earth still abide. We still have fruits in a season. We still have weathers and all much as them are build weathers and are create weathers. We still have the almighty God who control all weathers. And that's why feed them weathers, them can't win. You see where them try with Florida, with the black Jamaica and them weather go vote for Trump. Then try kill them out before the election come up the side of November. Because again, they're going to say this I mean, I'm going to itch and say it. If you don't have any sense and understand and I choose evil over evil. You know, look, pan where Donald Trump has set up America and the black people because it boiled down to sovereignty, you know, and the truth of God is a spiritual warfare right across the board, not only here in Jamaica, but Jamaica as the head of the world. It's the more shown out here because everybody is waiting to see what Jamaica is going to do so that they can know what to do. So they have really, really thought that all of Jamaica did dead and all of who did left, we said them a free from fighter, 
in the Buju them and the Ray Ray them. Them are bad for PNP, so that all is lost. All is not lost. You have some regular people out here. We are no celebrity. Them are no big superstar, but them know the truth about them island. And them willing to stand up and do something about it. And them could have done more than something. Then could have do the whole blood down Sandy Gully River approach. But that was not the mandate that them ancestor is not. Few blood supposed to run down Sandy Gully. Good Gully is them. We are going to fight for themselves. We are going to fight for them war. We are going to have for them differences because of the betrayal where them betray for themselves. We the people must sit down in our house and watch TV, watch it on TV with popcorn and drink some juice. And that we did suppose they do. But what they want to do is keep us in the middle of their fracas. While they use their influencers. I did warn Ratigan. Say when you're going to start your program. Make sure say it, it wasn't from no political perspective. Or no vendetta. Or no vengeance. Because when you're trying to do good. These people will do everything to crab your dung. And drag your dung out of the way. Now him see for himself. Him if he start over from scratch again. All of these people are batting for the system. That wants to keep you as subservants. If you don't stand up in your mind now and go back to your dashin and cocoa and breadfruit banana eating and buying food from your regular restaurant people then where you know where them call cook shop no one no see why them did want cut out cook shop out of jamaica because them never want jamaicans to be feeding jamaicans anymore them want we fear eat the food them we fi make we behave and act like them and how them want we fi behave and act and the best people that them could have used was with children them so them take with children them and start to grow with children them and start to influence with children them and start to educate with children them and start to tell with children them say to be sadamite is the way to be these days to have no morals to care less about yourself to feel like shit all the time and just drink it away and just smoke it away and just Go, go, club it away is the way to go. God is going to turn on a piece of rain and lightning and thunder. The real rain now, not the one we Andrew them by, but the real judgment is going to come. If we not do the right thing and do it right now, we have a window, Jamaican people, for save the world. The window is that we can stop 2030 vision. How we can stop it? By uniting the maroon communities, them uniting around the will of the maroons, the will of our ancestors, which was to not work for the system, but against the system, to unite the communities under agriculture, under development. We can't say it over again. All of these different things that we need to be doing in the communities to get the kids, their mind, back on track, seeing... No one no understand why we either say careful with TikTok them, careful with them up there because no one was leading Jamaica and they knew that they had to keep Jamaicans under control so that no revolt no happen down there. And if the revolt are gonna happen, it would be gay kids running up on straight men and Chubbing them off in the sea. That is the Jamaica where them prefer fair sell to the world. Say Jamaica reach a stage now where a straight man can depend on him live. I talk about the nastiness we are going to him country and some youth where say them gay can pull up on him. And him have to run, go jump off in the water. And everybody a laugh. And I say, yeah, man, Jamaica go on like them bad. And them could have, tell them to try it with every Jamaican now. Tell them to try it with every Jamaican. Try that something there with every Jamaican, let me see. See? You know the pan such a ears. If you turn Jamaica in a Saddam and Gomorrah. Try it with all that we make we see now. Push it down, fully it down in the wall of which one go make we see. You know, go always have the ones who you know, can influence. Again, I call to footer hype. I say, footer hype, I ask you to call my phone. I have some things to tell you, youth, to save you from the disgrace where you are going to end up and go turn up and defend down the road. If you don't come here where we have to set to your footer hype, you are going to end up be disgraced and you are going to end up shame and sorry and nothing where you are defend now going to mean nothing when the truth reveals. So if you not save yourself 
and make the right call and come off of your ego and come on off of the something there. You are going to go, go be the laughing stock of the 21st century youth. I tell you that right now. Seeing? Because I know go it a going now. I come it a come. You see, everything where them been planning and plotting against Jamaica and how them want Jamaica to be and Jamaica becoming the new headquarters of sadomism and you have some Rasta way in it too, you know. You have some Pan-Africanists way in it too, you know. Let me tell you something, Maxine's too. You can't come a Flagstaff, you hear that? You can't get Jamaica through Flagstaff. Maxine's too. You hear that? I mean, I care who I back you. I mean, I care who. I tell you, say you can come come in a Rasta and now you bingy business. Come go on, like I say, you want come take over. Come declare where you deal with Maxine's too. Come declare where you deal with no witch, no warlock. Now nah, come in. You know, here. No, 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 come in. So tell all of your vanguard them. Say, me say, they tell you, Maxine store. You can't get Jamaica. You can't get Rasta House. You can't get Naya Bingi. You can't get Maroon. You are your clone them. And all of Uno. We line up in our cultural especially you, Kabu. You see what you see what you do? You see what you sit down and allow in a Jamaica because you know not Jamaican, don't you? You know Jamaican, you know African. So what happened to Jamaica no mean nothing to you because you know not African. I hear you know. We are only one when it's suit to you know. We are only one people when it's suit to you know. Where the freedom fighter them, where Jamaica known for them. The whole of them isolate Queen Africa people. Them isolate me and say they don't want to not with me. You're mad, man. Why you, tell the people them why you don't want to not with me. Tell the people why you don't want to not with Queen Africa. You all are uno. We are sheep. And I tell the whole of the maroon coming to say me mad. Tell them why you say so. Kabu, my at Keru, my Muta Baru, my Muta Baruka, Bird Samuels, all of you front leaders in the Pan African movement. All of you front leaders in Naya Bingi movement. All of you front leaders in our music. You know front leaders. Tell the people them who are not lead. Come tell the people them who are not lead. Tell the people them why we can't have the kind of conversations them where we need to have. To fix things. Tell them. And stop tell them about me mad. Stop tell them in a private car. Them a tell me on the phone. Them a switch from you and a come and tell we now. Say so all you know say is that you know if talk, you know if talk to we call me mad. Queen I, they have mad Queen Africa over there. Because we now bow. Because we do not take no chat from you no, and no lesions them we sell you no. They can sell out we. And that's why I'm mad. And that's why I don't want to deal with me. And that's why I don't want to a conversation with me in a. Uno, front leaders, we are lead for PNP and labor right. Uno, artists, me attack. We are work for labor right and we are work for PNP. Uno, me attack. We are telling the people them say me mad and they not deal with me. Uno. Why don't you come tell the people them won't really go out in the back door? All I want to say no have file, cause then say they have file for drop on me. But they are tell them say if you hurry up, drop it. The word them come and check me with file, but then say they have for drop. See? And we are say drop it. Drop on no the file, then make everything come on the table. File fi file. Card a truth ya afi reveal. Me they a wait pan the file them. Me not see them drop none yet. You see me? Intimidate them a come try intimidate me. That me not fi come sit down and turn on them live here and tell them no say them a sell on no out. Them a sell on no out. Me know fi a fuck now. I no no talking now. We know fi a fuck. Say them a sell on no out. Them a sell on no out. Them are selling no out. Them are selling no out. You hear that? 
Yeah. Them are selling no out. Them giant up with the big guns, them. Because them all get to come ride around and be king over who know. Like we some of them are practice for do already there. I drive around and I dash with dash with money. Where they, where they, where they client them, I give them. I then client them. I give them money for make them thing look like it all right. Them thing not all right. You know, they pan no foundation. The ancestors no give no blessing. The ancestors no give. Gaia no give. Nayeng Kepong no give no blessing. Then are no blessing. I be a demons them. You see me? I lie them I tell you no. I know who know them I do where them I do for. I then self and then followers. Then sheep them where they gather up. We have figured bow to them. And yes, master to them. And them are the new slave of them. We want to ride around and drive around in a big vehicle. Pound no. Yeah, them see. Now real life. I that I go out in the background. I don't hide because it now nah, going to be said to me dead and nobody don't know why me dead. All of the name them when me I call, the whole of them know where them I do, them sign with the system. And then say, me fi dead. Okay? So I show where I show them say. I never that just say, you no. Know, I never that the creator say. The creator say, we forget we victory as a people. And those who have oppressed us must go now and leave us alone that we work out with our fears. And that we are bad for. And that we are bad for. And that them say we saw. So all those who are sitting on the sideline and it's time to get up now. Can I remember you know, whether or not something happened you know, where the changes is concerned you know. It will not be said that it is because we never say what we're supposed to say and do what we're supposed to do. We leave it in front of our eyes, man. We just never see. We just never see. See, I live where I live it true to where we attack. We live it, make us see, man. In a real life, that we could have dare me at the age of 50, can sit down for a life, you know, without walking stick and crook stick and nice, no blood clot, all teenager look me now. Seeing and can talk that truth the same way. Don't wounded, don't depressed, don't distraught, and then do me everything as you know, see me show on the quote paper earlier where Mr. Derek Morgan, the great skeleton, and his son, them send come say quote. And me, I say, yeah, because he did rape me for true. You understand? I mean, I hide that no more. I mean, I'm dead with that while them walk off. Happily ever after. If you're wrong, you're wrong. It don't matter who you be. It don't matter what your status is. Anyone are we? If we do wrong, we must be big enough to stand up and say we're wrong with that. But you want me to go feel away because you inner your feelings. You did it. You did it. You did it. American Courtney, your father did it. He did it. With or without no help from other sisters, them in other court case, yeah? He did it. And I'm going to sit in that courtroom and I'm going to speak my truth in that courtroom. Yeah. And be for every little girl, every little youth boy, yeah, wherever get violated against them will. Every youth, every youth will get raped and can't get over it. Because I know something where you get over. Or something where you have to tell yourself, say, you yeah, choose life over that. So I know something where you get over. So I'm going to show you, Derek Morgan and your son, them. And whoever back you in the family. Say, me not afraid of you. Know. And what you did was wrong. Yeah. Likewise, the governments and opposition of this country, I all out know where I come for. One go. Till the last breath left with body. We know for left, we are alone now. We know for left, we are alone now. 
On of left, we are alone now. You see me? Leave us alone now. We are the people, the children of the Most High. Leave us alone now, man. Give us a chance to breathe. Let us breathe. You can't victimize us and then you want to come re-victimize we again by turning us in a your supporters. So all a woman like me now, if you come up here, if you come be like them big stinking dirty sitting there where we now call influencers, if you come tell we little black children them, say all them good for a fi be whore and prostitute and spread out in that. Oh, taboo full, so. Eh? Eh? Oh, taboo full, so. Eh? How oh, so much are we young people, them? Just no care about nothing. No self value, no self worth. No care, nothing. They no, them, anything goes, you can do anything to them. What happened to them? Who caused that? Who no predator? Who no set a predator? We're in a high places where artists. I know my father and rape is alone as big artists. You have artists who are bigger than Bumbo Clark, Derek Morgan. Big artists. Big, more popular, no one now. we rape. Blood clad family too. I know my job for talk who. You understand? I be a rapist. A pedophile we have in a high places in a Jamaica. You think, say, anybody when you know one little girl when you Ali Carter, who no go look her up? She say, even Joe Biden, next she bow pan her, pan him. And them the kind of people we have a govern the world and I look up to as role model when a little girl can come talk and all when them a try kill her. She a say, him, make she suck in her dick as a blood clad president. So who them warm to the one them where we have a Jamaica? If him can't do that and a little girl can't put her life on the line and say she don't care no more, she attack all of them with hurt her. She call Borak name, she call Michelle name, she call Oprah name, she call some blood clad big name with the little girl I call. And she in it from who? From she a child. From she was a child, the child protection agency, them sell her to these celebrities. This is what we have here. So enough of we picnic them we're missing out of Jamaica where we where then there. We child protection agencies them. Where then there? Where we children them there? How much of them end up in a PDD ring? How much of them end up a PDD party them? How much of few Jamaican children them were missing? End up a PD the party them. Uh, in other something they were. Her name is Ali Carter. A L L Y C A R T E R. Ali Carter. She is one of the survivors. Her case is real. It is, it is a part of some of the cases that is up against the artist right now. If you hear from what age that little girl thing started, all the different big celebrities of the world and what they have done to her, she was trafficked as far as to Russia. Who is allowing that? Now come back to Jamaica. You, you know... So poor you know a few of them where we are some people then we come on on a TV and on a radio every day and come on stage can sing for uno. If you no ever know some sitting where them are going with behind closed doors. But they want to come play wrong and strong. And after my father raped me and me, wall it out throughout my career and do everything to keep me head above the water because me never want the people them where I love me for good on because me couldn't wall up. Because me couldn't wall up and me fight for myself and fix myself and make sure I say me, I'm all right for you. Yeah, me, all right for you. 
See, because I do the work where it make me all right. Me never turn to no drugs. Me never turn to no alcohol. Me never turn to promiscuity. Me never turn to sodomism. Me never turn to none of them something there because me had a right to her because of what happened to me. Me could. Me turn to God. Me turn to the Almighty Creator. Me ball day and night. I me say, me now let go your foot. Me now let go your foot till you clear me, till you clear me, till you clear me, till you show me how to heal. I saw me heal. And after me heal, and I try to help those who me can by showing them so you know, if you become victim of your circumstances, you can rise above the things that hurt you in life. Live your life. Be free. My family, them still dep on my case. Every time I go around them and I try to get them to talk to Derek Morgan, to make him admit to what he do, or at least have some remorse in a private over the years. Them not listen to me. Them disrespect me. Them glad in time the public at this me because them can't join it too. And say, yeah man, the public says she mad already. So them go say she mad if she said that about dada. And that's why me come out and free myself and make them know say, me never did I go live with a bandage for the rest of my life. So when I was triggered by that dirty man downtown near Derek Morgan where then take and put for trigger me. That was how me end up talk. Now that then getting at them feelings and draft a court paper and board defamation of character, I don't have no problem. Go defend your character, Mr. Sar. But no say, now nah, I go take her from the facts. So you raped me that night there at Greenwich Farm. You see me? Yeah. So now is the time where we now go sit down and suffer no more. We are going to stand up and rise above suffering and choose God and choose with self over suffering and choose to live because bad things happen to you don't mean that you should stop living. It don't mean that you should give up on who you are. You shouldn't give up on your purpose. You shouldn't give up on the things that you were born to do. You shouldn't give up on love. You shouldn't give up on a real relationship. You shouldn't give up on none of the things that make you happy that make you human that make you you who you are nothing that happening to you to you in your life should make you give up on who you are and the purpose person that you were born to be and moving forward in my life that is what i am living everything that i am doing to moving forward that's going to be my queen africa legacy to show even some of these young people that is going through some of the things that i went through when i was young that they can make it to 49 go Going towards 50 with them pride and them dignity intact, with them soul intact, with them love for God still intact, with them love for self still intact, them love for morals still intact, them love for life still intact. They don't have to give up. No youth will ever get raped and feel like you're, you're sexually confused. Don't have to be ignorant. Don't have to be traumatized. Don't have to be mad for the rest of your life. Turn to God, babes. All of my bridging them will ever get molested, rape a man, bully and this you and fuck you. That nothing determined, no darkness in your heart, youth. Be like the youth the other day, we turn on him live and talk, say them rape him and molest him and nobody now want to listen to him report when him go to jail. If all of we get up and stand up and say we now be no victim no more, then can't keep we as no victim. You can only be a victim if somebody keep you as a victim. And how them keep you as a victim, them rape you and ask you where you did I do forget the rape. That is how them keep you a victim. Nobody don't say. You know where some people ask me? What age me was. It doesn't matter what age you was. Rape and violation and rape and violation. Nobody don't have to know your age. They don't have to know your status to be wicked. People are going to just be wicked. If they didn't know your age, it wouldn't make a difference. If they never know your age, it wouldn't make a difference. If me didn't leave that night there, probably it would make a difference. But it was my father telling me to stay. And that's why I stayed. I had no idea that he would do what he did in the hours of the night. But he did it. And I had to live with it. Still is living with it. Even after this court case done, me have to still live with it. So I choose to live and not exist. I choose to live for real. I choose to be wholesome for real. I choose to accept my atrocities as simply that. Atrocities. Things that happen to my outer man and I use my inner man to fix it. And that is how we're going to help Jamaica right now. They tell you that it's your fault. That's what they tell you. They tell you that it's your fault.
It's not your fault why somebody violates you, man. It's not your fault. It's not your fault. Somebody being wicked, somebody being artless, somebody being careless is not your fault. It's people being who they choose to be. Not who they are supposed to be. My father in 2024 should not be in this situation that he's in now. But he was given a lot of chances even by myself. I begged him to do the right thing. He even said baptize and go to God then. Make me see say, yeah, put out an effort for sure remorse. You know, he didn't do that. He keep asking what me do, what me do, what me do. So, cause these people they don't they don't want to accept what they do, because they know it's wrong, but they do it in the darkness, and they think that no one is seeing, but God is seeing. And I am a child of God, and God saw what you did to me, and saw that it was not fair considering the road that I was treading leading up to meeting you. So. With that said, I am not sitting here talking as a victim. I'm talking as a person who was wrongly victimized and decided that I'm not going to be a victim of that for the rest of my life. And I am asking and beseeching anyone out there who can't get over a rape of a father, mother, friend, sister, brother, uncle, whoever it is that was close enough to you, stranger even, who violated you against when you look in the mirror all you're seeing is yourself getting violated you don't know where to move where don't turn to no alcohol don't turn to not would even encourage you to turn to no therapist turn to god man go inside accept the incident that's what muda said to jamaican people accept what them do man she said them wrong with what we don't have to take it though. we don't have to take it we can't stand up as a people were left. Those that we were left can't stand up and say, no more, man. We need to see the change where we ancestors dead for. We need to see the change where we are cry for. We need to see it. Stop watch them blaga vlaga ya. If them now uplift and edify uno and big up Jamaica and talk about the good of Jamaica. Stop. Because it's how you empower them is how them stay empowered. Uno sifu uno self say them no love Jamaica. Them no love we. That's why it's easy for them rape we so. That's why it's easy for them talk down to we. Them only love for associate with who we be as Jamaican. Them no love we. They no love we as Jamaican people. Them jealous of Jamaican people. All of them jealous of Jamaican. Original Jamaican people. We are we create with culture. And we create all the culture them where them are using in the world. Are Jamaica create. So that's why them want to create the new cultures them. And project them out of Jamaica. For just be sadomism, promiscuity, anything goes. Alcohol drinking, lewdness, wickedness. The worst type of wickedness now where you can't ever experience a Jamaica. You have to come to experience it. Africa, a wait pan we. Forget we shit together so that Africa can get for them shit together. You know, see we are going on a Burkina Faso. The youth have to look upon Andrew and say, Andrew, we see say you sell out sovereignty in a Jamaica. We need Jamaica because a Jamaica teach we how to defend sovereignty. And that the youth has said to Andrew, I'm going to go look up the video and go watch it with the bridging from Burkina Faso. We are trying to change him country now. The item see. So right now, may I tell the item. You see, we can afford to talk. That's why we come on here. So. And you know, see all we go on over the past couple of months. And what is about to come is what you know, need for you to pay attention to more than anything else. Because Andrew would love to call the election. But he can't just call it like that. Because the ground is not stable. Right? Jamaica is not stable right now as we speak. The country is not stable. And it is not stable because the devil want to replace God down here. And they are using people that you wouldn't even expect to be on the front line of who influence us towards that. So it is up to you, the people now, 
to decide are you going to surrender to the devil or are you going to continue to stand up with God who have been here for you all this time? You have to make that decision. That you see that the devil have done here now. The devil is, is, is calling victory. The devil is calling victory on the island. So, I am wondering if us as a people I go really sit down and make these people because who no see one make them popular, make them famous, make them into who them be. Who no go allow them now to come lead on back to Satan now. Me I go wonder. Me they I watch like everybody else. Most of we there I really I look for see if I that. So again, me I say me start here so me I finish here so near life. The time is now. Flagstaff Maroons decided that they are standing up for their communities by saying it loud now that they are the paramount Maroon communities of the world, not just Jamaica, seeing. And that is not out of vengeance or show-offness, but where the truth lies. And if you want to fix the problem, you have to look where the truth lies. And the truth lies within the Maroon communities of Jamaica. And if the Maroon communities of Jamaica are not willing to stand up and be the great defense that they say they are for the populace, then all is going to be lost. All is going to be lost and the Maroon will still parade here as subjects of the British and as they look down upon you, the populace. If that is not so, then let us come together and prove otherwise. Let us meet together. Let us all Maroon communities come before the people and let the people know that we are the friends of the people, not the enemies of the people. Because Queen Africa sit around this place as a free Jamaican. I am an original free Jamaican. I was not a part of slavery, did not take part in slavery. The only part we did take in a slavery was to help free those who did want to run away from the plantations then. And we did a help those who never want to stay in a slave, who them hacked upon the ship bottom them, and we rescued them. We are the ones who did do the rescuing, seeing, and I we them kill out, and I them me a peak for, them me attack for, and them me attack for, and my only alliance with Flagstaff is because Flagstaff is the unconquerable maroon community that did not surrender, and not only because. Flagstaff is not the only one. There are other maroon communities as well. But they are compromised because of their leaders who have decided to go with politics over the truth of who we are as a people. And we are asking these maroon leaders to turn away from their political affiliations and come back to what it means to be maroon and to fight for the freedom of the, the, the enslaved Africans among us. And to acknowledge the freedom of those who have us who come here as free people and never come here as no slave and never live here as no slave. You see me? The regular man. The regular Jamaican who can't understand how the country come to this. The eye them see. And that are the maths where they do down here. You have seclers. You have indigenous, you have transatlantic slave trade, you have Jews, you have Irish, you have British, you have a whole cocktail of nations upon this rock here. But there is a paramount set, and that is the set where them did come see upon the rock here. Black people, where did they hear a praise nine kepong? I praise God and I live in our love and Africans would trade and come along and we would trade to and from. I that we are recent our country round. We country are never no plantation island. We country are never no slave led island. We country never start with no slavery. And that the whole I don't know why we believe. So we, we country never start with no slavery.
We country never start with no slavery. And who no can't get if we accept, say, Jamaica did start with slavery. Jamaica never start with slavery. Jamaica infiltrated by slavery. And settlers who came along, you had good settlers, bad settlers. You had all different type, all right around the 14, 15 parishes. Different people did come settle up. All right there in a fax, in a context. It will be said, it will be said in the right and proper way in front of the right and proper audience. But right now, we are breaking down gutter style. For me, you know, say, yes, we know the dynamics, the diagraphy of Jamaica. We know it. We know, say, that's why we don't know who we kill, where we kill, when we kill. We know, say, that's why we don't know who we give, what to eat, when to eat, how to eat, where to eat. We know, say, that's why we don't indoctrinate, that's why we don't culture some, some way and culture some the other. Yeah, Romy say, when him party done, him say him never keep that the party for fit him fans them. Him say the people them where him a come a fi Swissly party now come a fit him party. Him say him now invite no fish to fit him party. 